हेलो गाइज वेलकम बैक टू फार्मा टाइम सो आई एम बैक विथ अनदर कॉलेज फार्मसी एक्सपीरियंस एंड रिव्यू एंड वॉट द एडमिशन प्रोसेस सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट नाइपर कोलकाता कॉलेज एक्सपीरियंस एंड वॉज द एडमिशन एंड कैंपस ऑल द थिंग टूडे वी हैव तन्मय भाई वी थर्स ही विल बी शेयरिंग हिज एक्सपीरियंस सो या इट्स वेलकम इन आई एम जॉइंग यू माय नेम इज तन्मय वर्मा एंड आई एम फ्रॉम लाइक गुजरात So, I did my B.Pharm from Pioneer Pharmacy Degree College, uh, which is situated in Vadodara, and uh, then after I cleared my GPAT and NIPR and applied for uh, NIPR. So I done my M.S. Pharm from NIPR Kolkata, and currently, like I I got admission in NIPR Mohali for Ph.D. So. थैंक to do some kind of research so like pharma people most of the do the uh, research on drug like develop the drug make some synthesis and so what we guys do like as a pharmaco informatician we we help them to do it faster using the computer so we know the computers how to do like basically in this field we have kind of three compartment one uh, like to produce like to make the programs which can help and secondly to utilize that program so there are two kind of people one who likes the programming and another that likes the uh, use that program so they are like good at analysis okay so they give some data and and we so another time just make that program they are not good at analysis so that's what we do so basically this uh, pharmaco informatics uh like i think nipper on this uh, providing this course and that is only uh, three places uh, nipper mohali kolkata and uh, hyderabad uh, hyderabad uh, open this course this year so this is it so if you are interested in like you took uh, pharmacy and then you realize oh i also like computers and what should you do so this is the course for you Great, great. So the now main question comes like, what is the admission process? Please walk us through your admission process of the college because it has oh. many things like to go into life form. Okay, so like admission is very straightforward. So once you clear GPAT, so for NIPR you it is necessary that you have GPAT clear. So once you clear GPAT, you have opportunity to appear in. nipper examination for masters okay so once you like they will give a, you your ranks and on the basis of rank you can choose a i think they are providing 20 courses different nipper offers a different seats okay so if you got almost like rank below 1500 like recent years or one year before like 2020 people got like Like two thousand also. So if they have rank up to two thousand, they may be admitted in some nipers. Okay, not in very good course, but they can be there. Okay, awesome. So, like, what? How is your experience at the campus? Like, 
okay so as i mentioned i did my uh, masters from uh, naipur kolkata so so we don't have actually much of a campus uh, so it like they are they have rented some uh, building which is like very good infrastructure is there we can like appear uh, but campus is not there like proper campus we don't have at uh, kolkata they are planning to take uh, it some building process is going on so apart from the campus what i like from the area of like kolkata naipur is like in very good area so whatever they renting the building now it is a very good place okay and uh, now it doesn't mean that naipur don't have campus so they might not have uh, that kind of facilities okay so they have very i think like for my department they have very good facilities what one should need like we just need one system like computer okay but in that also we need some high performance computer some average and okay so this guy so naipur kolkata have very best of the computer i think very few labs in india might have that kind of facility so if you want me like we have uh, we had actually i got passed out so uh, tesla v100 we have six card i think and uh, rtx 5000 six card okay and uh, apart from that like xenon processor with like 16 gb ram these are the average but the tesla cards are very good for molecular dynamic simulation so for faculty is like they are good okay so i have one guy he is very cooperative and good overall okay and uh, i like like overall structure is i i like that like i spend my two years and i enjoy yeah so it is good for research people because it provides best lab in the country yes 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 that's awesome so like uh, there is a project selection in mfarm so what you take on the criteria before selecting your project well so project selection is not like much of a difficult thing for like at masters level like most of the time they will offer us a list of project like this this things you can do and based on your interest you start like searching on them and then you told tell uh, to sir that okay i like this one and i want to go with that so he will like further suggest you what you can do next okay so for in my case uh, i didn't like there is some difficulties like during because of that pandemic so sir told me this these are the structures can you look what you can do so i i done my project on like finding the kind of chemical entity which can target the covid 19 so i targeted the helicase so sir told me there are some structures 52 structures are available from pandey analysis group on pdb so i just search go through that and find my interest okay sir i am fine with that so sir suggested me like okay then they do do process like that and i just this is how like i selected the project for other guys who they have prop like they told sir okay sir this is and they so in short we don't have to like that much uh, focus on like what i should do. okay if you have idea very good talk with your guide and they will like give guidance what you can do okay so i don't think that project is much of a difficulties for master student not for me at least okay okay so you are heading towards your phd journey so what yeah. you give advice to the people who are heading for phd like what to keep in mind and when to opt for okay so so the people who are like wanted to do phd and they finish the master so like these are the people like my colleagues i can say so they are like with me so i cannot give them a suggestion to do this do this but of course if you are master student then look for like phd what should you do like job or phd so one thing i can say is like do whatever you like okay so i like studying so i go with the phd okay so for if you clear gpat 
so this is like very good chance and you studied in naipur so it is very much good chance that you will get very uh, popular like research laboratory or some institutes which can give you a stipend okay so in phd you will receive like 30k right so 30000 rupees per month so this is like more than enough like we can call it as a salary or salary so this is more than enough to like pass so it is not that okay i have to be like my uh, do have to some okay you have to pay a fees so you have to save some but i think that is enough so and for job people uh, job if you are planning to do job and in industry for like whole your life so start after m farm or even b farm okay you will have experience and based on your ex- experience your salary salary will like at a good uh, post they provide you good salary on your experience but uh, some people don't like you know like 9 to 5 job or so go with the phd so it is a good one thing i like have in my mind is if you do it is not that the people who do ph uh, b farm or m farm and then job they are not good i think what i think like i i have one uh, of course i interact with my seniors a lot so there is one my uh, phd who guide me that so he already done a job for 2 3 years and then uh, came to naipur kolkata for phd so he suggested that there is one limit so if you do b farm and start your experience so there is one limit after the company people say you can't be promoted because you don't have the degree right yeah then after you do, yeah you do ms and then after some years you can't be you at the base of your master level you reach one uh-huh. like stage then after you can't like they they also want okay you have this this we want to promote you but if we promote you then we have to do some uh, compensation to other who have same degree same experience so might not have same skill but okay so we cannot promote you so this is one kind of limit so if you do phd so like this is the finest uh, position you can be at of course after phd you call the pressures only and that is very not good thing to be called so yeah. get it so as the hierarchy increases you have to polish your skill and upgrade for yeah. growth career at every stage of aspect so yeah yes. so coming to the end of the live session thank you so much tanmay boy for sharing your experience hope you enjoy the interaction yes yes thank you